was a giant mistake. Okay, I stick out like a sore thumb. I know, I know that I need new friends. Everyone here is so happy and giddy. I feel like I'm gonna be invaded by the body snatchers. I'm officially suicidal. That was a joke, Mom. I love you too. I guess I've gone a little grizzly Adams lately. Oh, well, breakups can be devastating. The boys and I will totally lift your spirits. Listen, can we not talk about this with anyone? Okay, it's a little depressing. Oh, chin up. Misery loves sodomy. Yeah. What, are you stockpiling for Armageddon with all that liquor? <laughs> Don't be silly. That's just our daily run. Let's go. Oof. You may notice our wildlife. They may look pretty, but don't encourage them. They're feral, disease-ridden, nasty creatures. Ugh, God, I hate deer. Quarter shares are better for the economy than half shares because they go to twice as many T's. Now, we're all half shares, but we go to all the T's. Okay, you lost me. T? Oh, honey, there's no actual T at T, unless it's the Long Island Ice Tea, and you want to save those for the high T and go easy on the Lindsay's on the low T. Oh, and never forget middle tea. It's newish, but as I say, it's absolute essential. When did you become this gay? Miss McCaslin's home ec class. Okay, listen, I just came out here to relax on the beach, uh, watch the playoffs, and forget about my ex, all well, right? you've come to the right place. Look around you. No cars, no crimes, no motorbikes. Not a single straight you'll see. That's for sure. Our home is drama-free, drug-free, a veritable zone of zen. Can't you hear the crickets? What's that? That's what, sweetie? The sleaze tack from the land of the lost. Oh, that's your new housemate. Hey, Harold. Oh, <sighs> yes, better. What a dump. What's that from? You know, what a dump. <laughs> Some Betty Davis picture. Oh, Philistine. It's not Betty Davis. It's Elizabeth Taylor doing Betty Davis. But which picture? Virginia Woolf. She wrote screenplays? Oh, God, I swear if we could get married, I'd divorce you. Boys, boys, your new housemate is here. This is Mac, who just transferred here from Oregon to teach underprivileged kids in the Bronx. Oh, how noble. Not really. It was the only job I could find on such short notice. Well, Mac, these are the Michaels. Michael, yes, or Michael, no? <laughs> Seriously? Oh, no, it, Michael, no is just his nickname. <laughs> but I have legally changed my surname to yes. It's a constant reminder to radiate positivity. <laughs> Michael, yes has become sort of a local celebrity in the Chelsea art world. And Michael, no has become a bitter alcoholic. If you'll excuse me, ah, I'm gonna go curate my liver. Cheers. I've been hailed for my groundbreaking work in feminizing traditionally masculine objects. A dildo is traditionally masculine? Come along, your new roommate can't wait to meet you. Roommate? Did you expect to have your own room every other weekend for $5,000? Yeah, maybe Staten Island. Oh, sugar. Lex? <laughs> Lex, honey, wakey, wakey. Well, unemployment takes its toll. There's only one bed. Well, they pull apart. Okay, I wanted to take a nap. Okay, in time, Rip Van Winkle. Come, come, tour's just begun. Oh, what is with that roommate? Oh, there's so much to say about Lex. Where does one begin? Watch your wallet. All right, stop it. You're scaring Mac. Harold makes the best chisms. Oh, what's your secret? Uh, 
I don't measure. Here you go, sweetie. <gasps> no, thank you. I've been on the wagon since autumn and I have never felt such clarity. Well, it doesn't look like they're getting back together. Ugh. Debbie Downer's gonna be a real blast this summer. Stop it, he's one of my closest friends and he's in a fragile state. I thought you said you hadn't seen him in years. He's still fragile. Besides, who else would room with Lex? All right, which one of you thieving whores stole my last anima? Wow, I loved you in Hairspray. Tell me, how were the last 10 minutes of the Roman Empire? <laughs> Does anybody have a lozenge? Uh, is that Mac? <laughs> I've heard so much about you. <laughs> I'm really sorry about the breakup. Sorry, they already knew? Listen, I've been on tour all my life. All I wanted was a solid relationship. Why would you end it after like 14 years? Ask the Michaels. Well, we've only put in 10. You make it sound like we're doing time. And your point is? Mac, for our 10th anniversary, we are giving ourselves a third. <laughs> A third what? Victim. A third boyfriend. Fuck you very much. We are currently interviewing for our thruple. Yeah, their last third left them for a couple of bears. Jason was two thirds ago. I'm not so good with fractions. Third third's the charm. Hey. <laughs> so you just like dumped him and moved to New York? He's like Marianne Singleton leaving Ohio for 28 Barbary Lane. Oregon, actually. Lesbian heartland of America. That would explain the footwear. Yeah, not a fan of the mantles. But I like the watch. Yeah, my boyfriend gave it to me. Well, ex. It's the only thing I have left of our relationship, and now he wants it back. Is that why he was calling? Yep. You're not giving it back, are you? Oh, no, you can't give it back. I can sell it for you on eBay. I'm a top seller. You're not a top anything. If you're really over him, send it back. I don't know. I feel weird without it. Smash it with a hammer and send it COT. You don't need unhealthy karma on your wrist. Anything else I should get rid of? I mean, the watch, the mandals, the beard. I'm sure we could find you more appropriate footwear in the drag basket. Drag basket? <laughs> You're kidding. Right? Uh, you don't want your tootsies stomped on at tea. Well, this is all I brought. Better to go barefoot? Survey says. Oh no, I know what you did last summer, Mikey. First rule of tea, never go to Mikey. Four Lindsay's, Brandon. You betcha, babe. Four. There's only two of us. Oh, trust me. You're gonna need two, too. You ready to get shot out of a cannon? What's in it? Okay, let me tell you. Fire water, five-hour energy, sugar-free Red Bull, Adderall, and a rimmer of Ambien. Isn't Brandon beautiful? He's a little young. Ah, and so flexible. You were the top in that scenario. Oh yeah. I'm a blouse. A what? You know, a feminine top. Yes. No. Yes. No. What? Uh, where are you? Baby, of course, it's gonna hurt a little bit, but you will get used to it. Just wet it with your tears. <laughs> Looks like Ido needs rescued from the AARP. Oh, rule number two, never come between Ido and his antiques. You, I like. And you, if you play your cards right, I'm gonna go up on you. <laughs> I'm game, how much? I'm going home to make dinner. Don't be late. I'm in a mood. Don't be late. Excuse, 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 excuse. Hey, what's your name? Dan. Bye. So tell me about your ex. I mean, how did it end? He cheated on you? With my best friend. And then he told me it was my fault. It wasn't your fault, babe. Boys suck. Some better than others. And Mac, it was your fault. For what? Picking shitty friends. <sighs> Listen, we are gonna have the best summer of our lives, okay? I yeah. promise. With Lindsay's help. <laughs> to Lindsay. Cheers. Oh, looks like you have a gentleman caller. Trust me, I'm not ready for a rebound. Don't be so selfish. Think of it as your pre-bound. So 
what do you think of high tea? Is there a difference from low tea? Oh, we're on the second floor. Yeah, well, it's my first time and probably my last. Honestly, I just want to catch the playoffs. No, oh, the Blazers always self-destruct. Hey, hey, watch it, buddy. I'm watching it. Yeah. I'm all about the beard. Daddies are the new twink. Hey, you want to head down to Sip and Twirl? Sip and what? Slip and hurl. <laughs> this daddy has got to get home. Mommy's cooking dinner. Hey, swing by my place later. Achieve with the game. 84 Black Duck Walk. All right. I'm going to be on you like rice on white. Oh, my God, you were like three minutes late and Eo was flipping her wig. Mm -hmm. But don't worry, I totally covered for you. Do you want to step into the bathroom for some more? <laughs> Is that back? Yes, mommy dearest. Sorry, honey, no more time for hors d'oeuvres. Miss Ito hasn't done her Kegel exercise today. Hit me up later for an after dinner, man. <laughs> there you are. How was tea? Oh, some guy shoved his hand down my pants. Hey, your first bar island handshake. Come on, dinner's getting cold. All right, for our first course, we have seared ahi, on soba noodles with a soy reduction, and micro -green. Oh. Um. I'm sorry, I'm not very hungry. Uh, me neither. Oh my god, Harold, VCR, like... Visible cocaine residue. I slave all through high tea, and you guys do hors d'oeuvres before dinner. I thought you guys didn't do drugs. It's, it's just, just coke. coke. Give me a bump. Why do I even bother? It all looks delicious. Oh, well, thank you, Mac. It's nice to be appreciated. Lisa, may I have a bump? You deserve a bump. <laughs> Give me a bump, or I'll call your sponsor, you fucking tyrant. Life is a cab or nailed. Okay, this one's supposed to be on the wagon. <laughs> Hopping on and off the wagon is the only cardio this one ever gets. <laughs> bump. No, tonight. Uh, okay, so, Mac, did you meet anybody at tea? Yeah, I uh, met a guy named Wee. Oh, I adore Asians. And I abhor rice queens. Unless they're false alive. Okay, I like old guys. It's what makes me hard. Yes, I have a job, and no, I'm not a hooker. When it comes to genitalia, I am a huge fan of less than average. God, honey, <laughs> supersize me. I'm telling you, if they're too small, by law, I have to toss them back. Toss them my way. Nobody's tossing them your way. Look at that face. Just toss them my way. <laughs> Did you have sex? No, we shook hands. How awkward. Did you make arrangements to meet later? Yeah, he invited me over to watch the game. I should use that line. Mm, okay. It's not a line. <laughs> I'm not going over there to hook up. Well, how are you gonna make new friends? Make new friends by having sex? Uh, yeah. That's so messed up. Why? Because friends are friends and boyfriends are boyfriends and you don't cross the line. Says who? In my opinion, we should stop trying to emulate the straights. They could learn a thing or two from us. Preach! Oh! Preach on! Amen! Yes, you're absolutely right, Harold. Like, how to find a throuple. A third may have saved your relationship. Well, I don't see how a third dick would have saved a bad relationship. Do not forget the balls. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? You're really not gonna make new friends by judging us, I'm Please. telling you. You guys judged me as soon as I got off that ferry. Well, that's because you have a big, hard stick up your ass, wow. Lady Sunshine. Boop, 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 really? Beep, beep, okay, boop. awkward. I'm clearing the first course. Michael, you're being obstreperous. I'm not giving obstreperous. <laughs> Darling, I said obstreperous. No, I listening to you. Can't you see how mean you are to each other? Mean? Am I being mean to you? Oh, I'll, 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 of course not. I'd be miserable without you. Well, back door, the Explorer is off for an evening troll. <laughs> that means troll. No, I know what you mean. <laughs> Harold, are you off to make new friends? Oh no, she's off to make acquaintances. Have fun at the meat rack. I thought you weren't hungry. No, I'm famished. Ah, <laughs> oh, I wish this dinner never would have happened. Don't worry. It never happened for the blackout Barbies. I mean, look. Oh, little baby. Uh. Oh, I hope I remember that. Hey, you guys. According to Grinder, there's a hot guy inside me right now. Oh. 
Whew, thank God the Blazers are dependable. <sighs> Thanks for inviting me over. I had to get out of that house. There's nothing like a hot jacuzzi <sighs> to relax you. You know, I don't even know if I can last the whole summer. Hmm. Do you think I should ask for my rent money back? I so want to fuck you. <laughs> yeah, that is not even going to fit in my mouth. You said anything about your mouth? You know, where are you? We're looking all over. We, I can barely get a signal. Where are you? Looks like Ginger washed ashore. <laughs> Ginger, more like Mrs. Howell. <laughs> no, <laughs> right. <laughs> Robin Bird! Organizer with the clothes on. Robin Bird! Morning! Ah, it's her! <laughs> Wee's Wee Wee has its own Wikipedia page? Uh, to think, I've dedicated my entire life to unearthing a mythical dick of death, and the whole time it was grazing between the legs of an Asian at high tea. <laughs> Wee's Wee Wee is a yellow submarine. Shock full of semen. <laughs> Ito, I told you that in confidence. Oh uh, shit, sorry. The big things come in small packages. Don't you mean good things? You say tomato. See, you shouldn't stereotype Asians, okay? You still can't drive for shit. <laughs> Lady boys, it's cocktail hour. <laughs> <laughs> it's not even noon. <laughs> oh shit. I left my watch at his house. Whose house? The guy he spent the night with after you chased him off at dinner. Dinner? We had dinner? I, that's, I got nothing, nothing. Max spent the night with. Dinner's luck. Oh. Uh, ooh, there is nothing more aesthetically displeasing than a prodigious penis. Well, I had to get my boyfriend's watch back. X, and it wasn't his watch anyway. He gave it to you. Well, either way, I had to get it back. Girl, you gotta fuck that watch back. No, I cannot go through that again. <gasps> Oh, wait, you're a bottom? Oh. Okay, I didn't say that. <laughs> ah, the lady ah. don't protest too much. <laughs> I'll get your watch back. 84 Black Duck, right? Yeah. Thanks, Lex. We're friends, aren't we? According to you, not officially. Hey, hey, while you're out, I need you to buy some things at the pantry. What, have I been shanghai into white slavery? I can't even read your writing. Oh, please, it looks like a font. Fine, I'm illiterate, and I don't have any money. You do now, and if you go blind, you can call me. How am I gonna call you if I have your phone? Precisely. But how am I gonna- And seam. Bottoms have beards. Oh. And this, and oh my god, I'm such a whore. Okay, so um, what about my friend's watch? Oh, right, that watch. I think it's over there by that jacuzzi. Oh. That's it. Oh. oh. <laughs> and your buddy was a complete freak this morning. Yeah, first he wanted to cuddle, then he started crying. Mac was crying? Yeah. Who needs that on vacation? I had to kick him out. You kicked him out? Yeah. Where the hell have you been? And where's my marinade? I may have left it at 84 Black Duck Walk. What do you mean 84 Black Hole? Everything's getting sucked in that place. How could you jeopardize my mahi mahi like that? Oh, and fucking G, that's an Asian? Who the hell is it now? <laughs> Must be North Korean. Oh my god, Harold, Harold. Check this out. Isn't it beautiful? Hey guys, what's up? Hey, delete that dick from my phone and go get my groceries. You slept with him. Is that a problem? Yes, it's a problem. Jesus Christ, what is wrong with all of you? You're all so incestuous. You don't even like him. I didn't say that. You knew why Lex was going back there. Yeah, to get my watch back. I got your watch. And you used it as a cock ring. There's no need to get unpleasant. We're all family here, let's not raise our voices. You know, not everything needs to be copacetic, Ito. There's nothing copacetic here. Okay, I'm done. No, let's... Mac, let's work this out reasonably. Harold Media, you're a lawyer. I don't do pro bono, I'm Republican. You know what, if Mac's not having any fun, he's just gonna ruin the rest of our summer. Let me be the first to vote him off the island. Nobody's voting anybody off the island, especially not an aging chorus boy who still owes me a quarter of his half share. No, you know, it's fine. The tribe has spoken. You know, I thought I needed gay friends. Boy, was I wrong. Girl, no wonder you had to reach back 20 years to find one. I'm not a girl. And despite appearances, there are no girls here. Then why are you acting like a girl? Because who cares if I slept with some guy you don't even like? I care, okay? Now why can't you guys just be normal? Normal? Yeah. 
On Fire Island, we don't have to worry about what's normal. It's the only place in the world we have. So out here, you're the one that doesn't fit in. Shut it, Lex. No, shut it. You're just stupid watch. No! Uh, I can't believe it's not waterproof. I have a hair dryer. Let it sit in dry rice overnight. Ancient Chinese secret? Trust me. Don't dawdle, boys. It's almost tea time. I don't think Mac is coming. Yeah, we had a little, um... Swim? Spat. Look, if you're really not having any fun, we can work out something with the money. You're not having any fun? <laughs> don't leave us. I mean... Did we do something wrong? No, no, it's not you guys. I just haven't been myself lately. <laughs> just this morning, I cried in front of a complete stranger. I'm starting over at 36, and I don't even know who I am on my own. I'm trying to have fun, but I don't remember how. Whenever I'm down in the dumps, I slip into a pair of pumps. <laughs> Harold, I don't think he wants the drag basket. You know, you guys just go to tea and have fun. I need a minute alone. Are you sure? Yes. I promise, I'll be in a better mood when you come back. Listen, I'll start dinner. Okay, see you in a bit. Aren't you going? Lindsay awaits. If you're making dinner, you're gonna need groceries. You wanna go for a walk? <sighs> I can't believe he left the groceries at Wee's house. I can't go in there, okay? I humiliated myself. Relax, everybody's at tea, you'll see. Hello? So we're breaking in? Are you uh, up for a little adventure? Hmm. <laughs> Wait, where are you going? <laughs> okay, next time try the front door, MacGyver. It wasn't locked? Of course not. Nobody locks their doors out here. I thought you wanted a little adventure. I most certainly do. <clears throat> Why are you marinating his mattress? Marinade? <laughs> this is a hopeless case of irritable bowel syndrome. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Does that look realistic? But then he ran to the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> but he didn't quite make it. <laughs> hey, save some of that shit for dinner. <laughs> wow. Who knew you had such a nice smile? Guess what? I heard Lady Gaga's giving out free Mai Tais around the corner. You are just Run, shit. run like oh the wind. God. Run, little one. Get back here. Narcissist. What? I am not interested oh. in your doppelbanger. <laughs> what? So tell me more. Did you really take Betty White to the prom? It's just a room. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> that makes you so much hotter. Just so you know, if there were two of me, I could get you from both sides. Ouch! <laughs> oh my god, you still got it, you little bitch. <laughs> Whoa. It's like someone was the victim of a hostile makeover. Baby, don't hate me because I'm beautiful. Oh, I don't hate you. Femme is the new butch. <laughs> I'm we. A little bird told me about that wee bit of irony. Oh, really? I think that little bird may have left gross at your apartment this afternoon. Have you happened to stumble upon them? <laughs> Guess you're gonna have to come over and check the lost and found. <laughs> huh. Speaking of little birds, I thought you two were cooking dinner. Everything's marinating. <laughs> hey, Black Yo, I hope you don't have anything going on with this one. Because you're not leaving with them. Why not? Because we don't like you. Plus, I hear he's incontinent. You can all listen to these freaks. These freaks are my friends. Worked! You are a Mensa certified genius! 
This is news. Mm. Oh, good morning. <laughs> okay, wait. All right, stop. You're hurting me. When I was on Beyonce's Master Cleanse, I had a vision. You had explosive diarrhea. Oh my. <gasps> I bet he has a puny penis. The tea pickle. He's perfect. What's up, bro? What's up? Want to hang at our place? Ito, this is your mother. Aunt Rachel showed me your Facebook to see what you're up to in New York, and we saw a gigantic penis. <laughs> oh my God. Shame on you. How could you? Aunt Rachel had another panic attack. Lexi? Lexi! I don't remember a lot of last night. Did we um, officially become friends? Not officially. <laughs> but we all summer. Fire Island is so magical. You said it. I think we found the perfect little third for our thruple. Surprise, I invited him over. Guess where he's coming Thursday night? To our home. Oh. I hate going home. We'll all be back in two weeks. Unless you still want your money back. Nah. You guys kind of grew on me. Ah? Uh, what'd you decide to do with that watch? <sighs> well, I don't want to keep it, but I don't think I want to send it back. I could sell it for an Eli still. 50% discount. No, I don't want to sell it. It's the heart of the ocean. <laughs> oh, I am king of the world! Woo! Queen, honey. <laughs> <laughs>